Hey guys, Gen Z Catholic here, and today I wanted to talk to you about the five things I love about the Novus Ordo. We've all been to Novus Ordo Masses, and we all love them, but today I wanted to share with you the five things that I love the most about the Novus Ordo. So let's get started. Number one, the priest finally is facing towards me. I used to get so upset at the unreformed liturgy when the priest would face away from us and he would talk to God instead of the congregation. But it's so much better when he's talking to God facing directly towards me. That way, it's so much less confusing, and honestly, I prefer it when he's talking to me and he's responding to me. It's a lot better that way, and I don't know why you tratties would want it any other way. It's like, uh, let's talk about your unreformed liturgy where the priest doesn't even talk to you. Number two is getting to shake hands with everyone else. Through all the silence and reverence of the unreformed liturgy, there was definitely something missing, and it was the handshakes. There's nothing more fun than getting to shake hands with everyone else at Mass. It's definitely a community moment that inspires us to be church together. And at our church, we like to do a bunch of peace signs like we're hippies. We like to have a little fun with it and do things differently around here. Number three, there's no chant or Latin used at the Novus Ordo. I was so spooked out when I went to the unreformed liturgy and they started singing chants and speaking in Latin. It's like, what is this? A gathering of the community to be bred together or some occult ritual? Needless to say, I'm glad that there's no chant and there's no Latin at most Novus Ordo parishes. True, Vatican II says we're supposed to retain both of these, but we don't actually believe any of what that says. Number four, the priest could go off script and start telling jokes whenever he wants to. Things were so serious and solemn in the old days, and everyone treated it like it was almost like the sacrifice of Jesus. But we know more now. We know that it has nothing to do with that scary sacrifice stuff, and it's actually about the community and sharing a meal together. And of course we need Father Funny Clown to tell a few gut busters at a glorified sacramental barbecue. Number five, the thing I love the most about the Novus Ordo is the fact that none of the church teachings actually really matter. Most of us don't even believe in the true presence of the Eucharist, and we contradict the church on major social teachings, but that doesn't matter. Church teaching is basically a build-your-own-adventure book. As long as you don't get too traditional with things, you get to do whatever you want, and it's all fine. And that's the thing I love the most about the Novus Ordo. So guys, be sure to leave a comment down below about the thing you love the most about the Novus Ordo, and I'll see you guys all in the next video.